Well, here it is, the easiest monster in the Powerpuff Girl series. The eye monster that sees everything it sees. But its weakness is Blossom's messed up hair thanks to Bubbles and Buttercup. The monster forces his eyes. He's a laughing so hard. Er, I can't see anything until Blossom is gone. And the and Buttercup and Bubbles are no match for the monster. Has laser eyes. He has that everywhere. It goes. No matter what they do, they can't harm that thing. But luckily, Blossom comes back. Like in the nick of time. And the professor told her to say it doesn't matter about her hair being messed up. Um. What signs what's inside that counts. And saves her sister from being laser eye beam and forced the monster to eye monster to laugh. And have all its eyes shut full of laughter. Luckily he bubbles and Buttercup use their ability. He used the Range weapon to knock the monster to orbit in outer space while still laughing. This monster that make a few comebacks in him and Seek on the Game Boy Advance. Most likely in the anniversary of the Powerpuff Girls, and most likely in the other one in the Primo. Bumpers commercial. This is a giant simple eye monster that does see everything inside, but being forced to laugh with Lawson's ridiculous hairdo. This one's a pretty great simple design of a monster. That's just a foaming ball full of eyes. It's but still a pretty cool looking monster design that's a floating ball and we all seen them in many times before that most monsters that have lots of eyes are one eye this one has tons of eyes all over its body but still one of my favorite kind of monsters in the Powerpuff Girls series this one takes the cake to be the easiest one to do artwork design see you in the next video mites